folks, we can get settled. I now call this meeting of the 8th Annual Logging Modelers Pacific. I don't remember what I called it. Anyway, the Congress. Thanks for coming, folks. It's going to be a beautiful day. We're anyway, uh, we're very happy that you're here. This is, of course, our 8th annual event. The quality of the models here is just unbelievable. I think uh, in terms of quality, this is one of the finest contests we've had so far. Last one I gave you, I want to make sure I didn't double up on your numbers. Okay, no, I got it right. So, Jeff, the rolling stocks have been going here mostly. Steam locomotives on the next table. was up and up towards granite which is to the west up into the mountains this run of the railroad went basically to there that's McEwen and that was the beginning of the operation for years for actually five years the railroad went as far as McEwen uh, so anyhow this is a, uh, a digital slideshow with music um, and uh, the music's not going to please everybody, so uh, just uh, just enjoy the show. Uh, it uh, it kind of shows the, the three years of the demise of the railroad uh, and, and photographs. Uh, the Pomeroy Living, Living History Farm. At the moment, they're set up with a spar tree. Uh, I believe it's a, a heel boom. I believe it's got a heel boom set up. I do ready-to-run track, so uh, 
This is for the people like me who just don't get into hand laying. Anyway, this is what your typical model railroad track looks like when it comes out of the box. Now, it doesn't look a darn thing like this, except that it has rails and ties and assorted small detail associated with it. It got caught on a stump, and it jumped it. And the damn thing went up like this and landed right on top of the cab. Of course, he had the, he had the rule of protection. Surprise is the yard that was kind of due east of the SP yard, which you can see in the background there. If they had less than 76 cars, the dispatcher generally would let them cross right over. Geez, I thank you guys for, for saying something about this. Uh, and I'm glad I got here before I petered out. Both of you are a ham. Here, try that again. <laughs>